Dominique Samuel, let's kick off with you, your greatest Britain, please. Well, my greatest Britain is Catherine. I think she's absolutely amazing. Oh, wow. Yeah. <laughs> I fun. hope she's still on the line. Yeah, no, as someone who comes from a working class background, I know that what she said was completely correct. I didn't go to Oxbridge, I didn't apply to Oxbridge, but I was the first person in my family to even attend university. And that, for me, was a massive milestone. And, you know, the big bankers in the city, those that goes to, go to Oxbridge, that's not the story for the vast majority of working class people. And there's nothing wrong with being a teacher or a plumber. And the middle class lefties who want to Absolutely. sneer at Catherine's comments just show their own hypocrisy and actual snobbery. Yeah, and by the way, there's, there's nothing wrong with working at Tesco's or McDonald's either because you're providing exactly. for your family. You're earning a wage for your family. Absolutely. Sean Bailey, your Greatest Britain nominee. My honorary Greatest Britain nominee is a 15-year-old Ukrainian boy by the name of Andriy. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. He's a drone enthusiast, a good pilot, and he used his drone to spot an attack coming on the capital by the Russian forces, which enabled the Ukrainian forces to repel the attack. So I'm just so impressed that that young boy showed, showed initiative and just supported his, his family and, and, his, and his fellow Ukrainians. And Amy Nikal, your nominee. Um, my nominee is Siobhan McDonough for responding perfectly to Rishi Sunak's claim that he will give his £400 fuel allowance to charity. I think we can see this pointing moment. Pointing out actually. that you can't be philanthropic with our money, Rishi, you millionaire. <laughs> Well, I'm donating mine to charity, so I made that clear a couple of weeks ago. So again, just to, to answer your question... that's very philanthropic, well, oh, oh. Ch Chancellor, but isn't it being philanthropic with other people's money? OK, well, look, I oh, am going to go for... <laughs> thing that the Labour Party do, they're philanthropic with our money. I am going to go for Catherine Burwilson as tonight's Greatest Britain after that incredible speech uh, as part of her new role. So well done to Catherine, who obviously we just had on the show, so that was very good.